In Brussels, the President reaffirmed America's unbreakable commitment to our NATO allies in Article 5, stating clearly that NATO is rooted in, quote, the courage of, of our people, the strength of our resolve, and the commitments that bind us together as one. There may be some skepticism here, too, given some of the headlines, but you heard, you heard the President convey a direct necessary message on our commitment, as well as the need for all allies to meet pledges, increase responsibility and burden sharing, and focus on counterterrorism. And I'm sure you heard the criticism that the President somehow, by being so direct, alienated America's oldest friends. But many of our closest allies and Secretary General Stoltenberg personally thanked the President for leading on the issue of spending at least 2 percent of gross domestic product on defense. They know that sometimes it takes plain speaking to spur action. Due in part to President Trump's request, NATO as an alliance has joined the counter-ISIS coalition as an, as, as an alliance. And the vast majority of NATO members are answering the President's challenge by resolving to increase their defense budgets.